Paideia is an interesting word. It's an ancient Greek word. Uh, the Apostle Paul appropriated it into the book of Ephesians. But in ancient Athens, that was the goal for all the children to be properly instructed so that they could be good citizens of the city of Athens. That's the origin of it. Uh, so when you look at how the Apostle Paul's using it, he's saying for Christian families, make sure your children are raised up so they can be good citizens of the kingdom of God. And that was always the American dream, that we would be a city set on the hill, that we would be an example for all people of what could happen to a nation that obeyed the commandments, that had instruction, biblical instructions. Look at the McGuffey Reader. It was one of the most popular books of all time, sold millions of copies uh, back at the turn of the century. It was the standard for education, and it was a profoundly Christian series of readers. Uh, John Dewey came into the picture, and suddenly everything changed. It, it's one of those everything changed suddenly, then it took about 100 years. Uh, you look at what he did, and now suddenly it looks so completely different. It's because of the gradual erosion of our educational system. We no longer view education as something to build up good American citizens who will live in the fear and admonition of the Lord. Uh, we look at it as how can we tear the system down? Well, the book is called The Battle for the American Mind, and it's available wherever books are sold.